everyone. This is Dr. Din and Dr. Paraz. We are at your service. Today, we are finally here after uh, promising to be here for like a couple of weeks previously, but Dr. Perez finally was able to take time out for the question and answer session. So here we are. Uh, so today we're gonna to be talking about our new machine, which is Alma Duo. It's in, uh, you can see the poster in the back. It's a revolutionary treatment for men. Eventually it's gonna be approved for women also. However, right now it's only for men. Uh, anyway, so Dr. Perez, L uh, let's uh, talk a little bit about uh, Dr. Perez. So we will introduce Dr. Perez. Dr. Perez is my one of my favorite teachers. He's a nephrologist, which means that he's smarter than everyone else. He doesn't want to show it. However, he's very, very smart. He's a nephrologist. He was like everybody that I know knows him. He has been our teacher for years and years. And I am so happy that he decided to come and help us out with our beautiful treatment uh, for men. Uh, so anyway, Dr. Perez, uh, I do have a lot of questions that people have been asking about Alma Duo. And my uh, hope was that today I'm gonna be asking you some questions ad hoc and you can say hi to our uh, uh, clients and uh, patients. We didn't announce this live. However, okay. we're gonna record this and then clip it up and chop it up and put it everywhere else later on. So on, uh, buses, it, on public buses, on public buses and <laughs> in public <laughs> toilets and everywhere. No, just kidding. Uh, anyway, so what is Alma Duo? And uh, 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 tell us a little bit about uh, uh, what kind of a machine it is and uh, what it does. It's a machine that uh, delivers shock waves. Mm -hmm. uh, and in this case, it's directed at uh, blood vessels. Yeah. And uh, it helps to open up blood vessels. Very nice. And it is like, yeah, it is ultrasound, uh, as I understand. It's different from ultrasound. I it's, see. Uh, it's shockwave, so it's, it's shock really mechanical. I see, vibrations. I see. I see. But it's not the shockwave uh, therapy that they use for uh, lithotripsy when they have kidney stones or is it like a slightly bit uh, less uh, intense? Less, less energy, but yes. uh, same idea. Same idea, I yeah. see. Yeah, because that is the same exact treatment. Uh, even if it's say we call it shockwave, uh, one There's of no the shock. There is no shock. The shock will be afterwards where, you know, you'll be like, wow, <laughs> it happened. <laughs> it actually happened. <laughs> it can do things. <laughs> it is uh, very, you know, uh, declining sexual functionality in men is like, uh, is uh, basically uh, uh, an issue that people are sometimes shy to talk about. However, it is a pre present problem. Uh, too bad this uh, treatment is not really covered by insurance uh, yet. When we do, uh, what is, uh, for people who do not understand the mechanism behind erectile dysfunction, like what happens that leads to the, um, uh, do, to the symptoms? So it's um, kind of complicated, but simple. The, mm -hmm. the, it's blood flow mm -hmm. and it's circulation mm -hmm. into the penis that makes it erect. Mm -hmm. And the better the blood flow, the better the erection, it functions yes. better. Yes. Yeah. And the so the medications that are used or the tools that we are uh, give providing to men, um, why would you think that uh, Alma Duo treatment is superior to the medications that are uh, present, right. or is it like some kind of a combination uh, therapy that you see invasion going forwards for men? Right. Since blood vessels can adjust. Yeah. Uh, the medications um, improve blood flow, mm -hmm. and they, but the problem is they work on many different, different blood vessels, and mm -hmm. that's why they have a lot of side effects. Yeah. And the Alma Duo is working local, mm -hmm. where the where you need the effect. Yeah. And the and that effect is long lasting. Yeah. Uh, once you have a good effect, it lasts for a long time. It because it changes the structure. I see. Of I the see. blood vessel. Well, that's uh, so. Would you recommend it to men for like routine health maintenance? For duo. For duo. Yeah, I think so. Because um, by the time people realize they have a problem, 
we, there's a lot of treatment that would be needed to fix it. I see. So Almadro is uh, kind of preventive. I see. The shockwave. I see, yeah. I see. No, that actually makes uh, sense that if uh, by the time a problem has occurred, it's kind of difficult to manage it and prevent. Prevention is always uh, superior. From what age men uh, should get this treatment? Well, I would say around 40, 50, people start needing I see. some kind of, uh, because by that time, any changes in the blood vessels are already showing up. I see. And I see. if they have high blood pressure or diabetes, they mm -hmm. see it sooner. I see, I see. Can Elma Duo be used if patient has uh, um, prostate cancer history, uh, his, uh, a history of prostate cancer or any cancer? It's not designed for the problems that come from cancer. those treatments. I see. Yeah, I it's, see. A, it's a whole different uh, ball game. Yeah, so I guess, you know, especially if you suffer from cancer, then I don't think it is a great treatment because uh, it's contraindicated because you don't want to grow uh, more blood flow and vessels to the tumor uh, or cancer cells. So it's contraindicated for anybody who has history of cancer or is currently uh, on any cancer treatment. Can, uh, if Elma Duo grows arteries and vessels, can it be used to treat diabetes, uh, diabetic neuropathy, right. for instance, in feet yeah, and feet? This treatment like is used in many other conditions. Um, in this case, um, it's directed at one particular function. Yes. But uh, it's useful in other areas, cardiac or yeah. even uh, spinal. Yeah, one of the uh, one of the very important things that I uh, actually found out uh, for, uh, was that they started using it for erectile dysfunction only after finding it useful for growth of uh, new vessels in cardiac treatments and in diabetic neuropathy. So, uh, if at some point it, FDA clears it for other uh, things also, uh, you know, uh, it's coming. It's a, a, a so I, I totally I, this is a very good question. Um, again, if a patient wants the treatment only for sexual enhancement, how many treatments will he need? I think uh, everybody should think of six treatments. Mm -hmm. That's the standard. Mm -hmm. uh, and well, right now, uh, how often do you say a treatment is supposed to be done? Like when they initially uh, do the treatment, is it once every two weeks or once can it be once a week? Or something like that or can we customize it it's always open to discussion if people are leaving town mm -hmm. but the regular schedule is better yes because you get it over with um, it's more effective that way um, okay um, the, another question is must a patient continue taking Viagra or Cialis after getting uh, an Alma duo treatment if they, if they feel they need it, they can continue taking it, but the need for it will be less as okay. time goes by. So they can cut down the dosage. Right, right. I actually did uh, treat uh, uh, some clients and I actually told them to cut down the dose and they were able to, instead of taking it every day, were able to take it uh, alternate days. Um, do you recommend testosterone boosting shots while on Almadua treatment? If they need it for whatever reason, they can continue. There's no contraindication. I There's see. no I see. Uh, effect. Does diet and exercise have any impact on the progress of erectile dysfunction? Diet and exercise diet is and good exercise for all have, of life. Yes, it's, a, it's a, on everything. <laughs> diet and exercise has an impact on everything. So if you suddenly gain 20 pounds or 30 pounds over a period of a short, whatever, uh, whether it's a few months or years, it is going to have an impact on your uh, body's functionality, whether it is just sexual function or any other function. Uh, what are the side effects of Alma Dua? None. Zero. Zero. However, uh, it is not covered by insurance and uh, sometimes people tell me that uh, the paying out of pocket, which is not a small one treatment costs around $1,500. So, um, you know, the, when, you, when you do a full set of uh, treatments, it can uh, rack up a bill. However, you have to figure out uh, what is the value of this treatment for you. Is it painful? Not at all. It is not painful. Is there any downtime? No, not at all. You come from work, go back to work, 
Get it done. It's a simple 10 to 15 minutes uh, lunchtime procedure. We will uh, come back with Dr. Perez one more time and we will talk again about how often uh, can we do these treatments. Take care. Bye-bye.